y'all it's Jamala C but if you're really trying to be locked and loaded you can call me Mella if you're new here be sure to like comment and subscribe if you're returning welcome back boo welcome back today I'm gonna do a little productive thing in my life beating procrastination and doing the things you like while being productive you know yeah so it's really hard for me to like Stay productive. I have my days. Some days I could go like a whole day being productive. Other days it's like <sighs> immediately no. But today I want to be productive and do things I like as well. So I'm gonna show y'all how I would do that. The thing I want to do: watch YouTube and crochet. Things I need to do: chores, cleaning, and all that jazzy jazz, dishes, all that. So what I'm gonna do is every hour I'm gonna fluctuate until I'm completely done with things I need to do. You know, so one hour it's gonna be something I need to do. Next hour it's something I want to do. I feel like that's gonna be the best system because at least I'll still be enjoying myself and enjoying my Sunday while I'm also doing the things that I need to get done. But don't mind the hell, I just finished moisturizing it. That's something that I needed to do. Like I don't know, like keep it up with my hair is a lot and to moisturize and deal with it I just like uh, but I'm trying to get all of that because maybe I can probably take care of it is if I do what needs to be done moisturize oil it do all that jazzy jazz so I just finished spraying it I did a spray bottle mixture with leave-in conditioner water and uh, curling cream or something I added a little bit of oil to it as well and that mixture just is how my hair nice and soft or whatever and then after a couple days it started getting dry but then I just get lazy so I don't do what needs to be done, but we're trying to cut back on that and stay on the taking care journey. The hair journey. Stay tuned for the rest of the video. So it is currently 10.42. What that means is I'm going to be doing some dishes and maybe folding if I have enough time for an hour. And then I'm going to start on my crocheting. Period. I caught it while it was 11.40, but approximately one hour. I washed the dishes, went for some water, washed up my Stanley and all that. But I have to write a list of everything that I need to do so I don't forget. Let's do that. <laughs> I'm about to plan my day and whatnot. I do that on Notion calendar because I love it. It links with my Google calendar. And I don't know, I just like putting in the time slots and everything. So let me... Take out through this as I do it. Let me decide what I'm gonna do for this hour. Plan, eat, make something to eat. Record intro for the next video I'm doing. Start the video <laughs> if I have time. If not, it'll roll into the next session. Video. Okay, and then from 12, oh, uh, from 12.45 to 140 full clothes read intro it's like a full close for 30 minutes and I'm gonna read an intro for a chemistry class I have because I'm not behind on that so I just trying to use the day to catch up read the intro handout and PPT next block we're gonna crochet and watch YouTube or something or maybe I'm gonna start rewatching watching Grey's Anatomy I'm not sure finish full clothes S N 2 PPT and handle okay so yeah I could plan until up to 345 and then after I have all the clothes finished I'm gonna sweep and mop white mirror something but yeah, let's get to this. We don't plan, let's make something to eat. Or quad intro and start the video. I planned and made my intro for my video. Number eight. I made a hot dog sandwich with some cheese. I don't have no meal or no ketchup. 
This is very much dry. Still tastes good, still slap. I probably can start rewatching Grey's Anatomy just to have something to watch like when I bought or something. You know? And it's like when YouTube and YouTube in, I just go over to Netflix, period. Netflix don't have nothing good, so <sighs> time to start rewatching. I can't rewatch Gossip Girl because I just rewatched that last year. I gotta give them the next like two years or so for my mind to forget about it. Then be like, oh yeah, let's go watch our comfort show. Gossip Girl is my comfort show. Like I love Gossip Girl. Like it's my comfort show. I just love it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It just resonates with me. I love it. So, but yeah. And two sandwiches because I'm a fatty. It's 12:40. So that means it's time for the next block. On this next block, I have full clothes, read intro, and handout. How I'm gonna full clothes for 30 minutes. Read for the next 30 minutes. While I'm full and clothes, I'm gonna be watching series as well. So still enjoying myself, but yet standing on it. Business as well. Fine. Ten days since I watched, but I haven't folded this yet. But we gonna get it done today. I just hate folding, y'all. Like I don't know. I hate folding. Folding is so much work. But we can get it done. pants on hangers because they're heavy and they take up a lot of space well they're big and bulky and they take up a lot of space so I just put them on a hanger take up less space I'm gonna read for 30 minutes and then get to crocheting and series section everything up in like chunks and blocks and like an for this owl for that just keeps me seeing, keeps me up. So I don't feel so unaccomplished and like I only did one thing for the whole day, you know? I have an opportunity to do different things, to do a collection of things, to do multiple things in the same day, you know? And not just focus on one thing, but yeah. finished my hour of work and folding like 30 minutes 30 minutes equals an hour so now I'm gonna crochet and watch some series for another hour to you know balance it and wind down period so at 2 40 I'm gonna stop and then finish folding and finish my lecture because I didn't really finish it so I'm gonna devote the next 30 minutes to that as well I just was like, you know what, why not? It's technically cutting into my time, so yeah. So most of the clothes, I just have to fold my underclothes and stuff, so we could count fold in, crossed off, I guess, yeah. I hate the fact that we don't have drawers in the closet, but whatever, you gotta work with it. Now I'm gonna crochet for a while. I'm gonna leave mopping for last. I don't know, I'm really against mopping right now because my mind, oh. But I'm gonna sweep and mop next session and look at some work as well. Dance! That makes sense. That makes sense, y'all. Like, I'm here reading this powerpoint because my chemistry professor he posts handouts and powerpoints i read the powerpoint earlier i mean i read that handout the word document i read that earlier 
and now I'm reading a PowerPoint and it's basically like a condensed version but the PowerPoint made it made sense because that was something I highlighted in the handout and I was like I gotta go back over this but they had the explanation of it in the PowerPoint so it's like if the handout is a longer version why wouldn't the actual explanation be in the handout but now it makes sense to me you know <laughs> you know <laughs> just came out of the shower I like to shower while my floor drying because yeah I don't want to be on it and I have to come out of the room like when I finish the last part of the floor so I'm gonna just sit up in the kitchen because I don't feel like but yeah I went to shower while my floor was drying now I'm about to crochet until 640 then wipe down my mirror spray 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 wipe wipe and read 640 right on the menu I'm going to finish this row do an next row and all that other jazzy jazz I'm not really too pressed about that. Wipe down my light switches, my doorknob, my fridge, my closet handles, the windowsill, safe. And yeah, wipe my mirror. Like every now and then I just like to go in and do a good little wipe because I don't know, ever since COVID times I've just been really like cautious and like, ugh, germs, germs, germs. So when I really feeling like it and up to it, then I try to go in and do a little deep clean, if you know what I say. I read for a while and then to my hair. It's 741. I'm gonna finish reading. I only have a couple more pages to do so. Okay y'all I finished reading and reviewing for the night. Now I gotta do my hair and braid it down. Watch some series. Then go and cook. Period. <laughs> some change but not even an hour yet but what's up i did this style now i'm gonna roll my hair back bring it down for the night that's me i went to cook when i was like nine something it's kind of late so i don't know i'm feeling lazy bring my hair down now it's time to go cook it's so late but y'all are really hungry and i only don't pass some chicken so this really shouldn't take long or should it i don't know <laughs>
all for the model period now we put a child down put a child down and call it a night i hope you guys took something from this video and could apply these to your schedule your daily to do getting things done being productive you know one hour productivity one hour to when you like period that's the end of this video be sure to like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for the next one period bye